All right, guys, so real quick, I want to show you how you can add the clock in and clock out button here on your Square POS, which took me forever to figure out exactly how to do this. But once I did figure out how to do this, I figured I'd make a video so I'd show you how you can do that. So you can have your employees clock in and clock out directly from your Square register versus using their team app, or you can choose to use their team app. But it's just a few simple spots that we need to enable a few things and i'm going to go ahead and show you how to do that right now so let's jump in all right guys so here we are we are in a skirt our square dashboard and we want to go to the menus tab so as you're familiar with the your tabs here you want to go to where you have your menu and then from your menu you're going to go to your edit pos layout and then once you're in here see right now i have the clock in and clock out now to get this clock in clock out here if you go ahead and click the plus button and then from here what we want to do is we want to do an action so if we click action and then you can see clock in and clock out so if we click that and hit add one action there is we added it okay i like it I like it tall so i just made it tall okay so there we have we have that button now if you just add that button from here once you get to your POS and you click that button, nothing's going to happen. So you have to enable that button to work so your people can clock in and clock out from the POS. So the next place that we want to go is we want to go to shifts. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and go over to shifts. I'm sorry, not shifts. But from shifts, what you can do, what we did is from clock in and clock out, so you can let your team members clock in or clock out using their app which you can toggle on and off here we prefer them to clock in and clock out from the register just so we know that hey they're in the store they clocked in hey they're leaving the store they clocked out versus you know maybe clocking in from the parking lot before they come in and then clocking out as they leave okay so you can toggle that on staff clock in clock out now how to enable that time clock in and clock out from your register you're going to want to go to the devices tab okay so we're going to go to device management then from here you should see your device and you click the three buttons here when you do edit now and here's where you can enable all that so if we scroll down all the way to the bottom here Did I go past it? I think I went past it. Okay, here we go. So under, you want to find the shifts part of it. And it says, allow team members to track time on this device. So when you go ahead and click this, it's going to allow team members to clock in and clock out and track breaks right on the point of sale. Okay, and this is going to enable that button. So when they click it, it'll pop up their passcode and they'll be able to clock in and clock out. Okay, and then once you make that change, you're going to want to save it. All right, guys, so here we are back on the POS. Sorry about the shaky screen here. But you can see that we now have the clock in, clock out button on our PS, POS. So now when your team members go ahead and click this, like here, it'll go ahead and pop up their passcode. So they can simply put in their passcode, and that will clock them in for their shift, as well as when they put it in, it'll clock them out for their shift. So again, guys, I hope you found this video useful. If you have any questions, concerns, please leave it in the comment box below, and I'd be happy to help you out with that. And then again, just real quick, when you want to add that, you want to go to your Edit Shifts spot on your Square dashboard, and you want to go ahead and click Allow Team Members to Clock In and Out and Track Breaks on the point of, point of sale. So again, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate you guys, and I hope you have an awesome day. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.